All right. Okay, cool. Perfect. Man, Nathan Prescott is messed up. My sex is a little dangerous. gone now. This day never ends. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. That actually works pretty well. I just hung the light on the other light. Five years hey, man, Mouse, how are you? So it just came up for me. Oh, okay. Don't give and me the sex gone, mostly. Please pretend you're glad to see me. I am Thank seriously glad Maybe I don't need to get new light fixtures. That actually works pretty well. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. It makes perfect sense. I'm just gonna get another lamp to on those eyes. Yay, we're out of safe. So what did that freak want with you? My God. Oh, why isn't my mouse working? There we go. It's like shit. Hopefully I broke nothing it. Nothing after today. <laughs> so that's all we need, right? Mason? Still just need a light. He's just another top, Arcadia though. asshole. Your friend really took a beat down for you. Warren. Yeah, I owe him big time. You're not the only one in debt, and you're already better. causing trouble. I thought it would be quiet here. It feels so weird to be back. So I guess Seattle sucks hard? And yourself, I'm good, thanks. I guess. It was cool, but I, I felt kind bit. of lonely, out of my league. I would think you'd fit right in with the art school hipsters. Right. You look like the cover of hipstergirl.com. At least you're still a smartass. That's why I'm here. <laughs> Please, girl. You came back for Blackwell Academy. Of course. It's one of the best photography programs in the country. And my favorite and teacher, world. Mark Jefferson. So you came back to Arcadia for a teacher, not your best friend. Don't you think I'm happy to see you? No. You were happy to wait five years without a call or even a text. I wanted to. I was just so tripped out over leaving Arcadia. Oh, please. I'm sure your phone and laptop were frozen in time. You're merciless. Well. You've been at Blackwell for almost a month without letting me know. No said. I just wanted to settle in first and not be such a shy, cliche geek. I totally would have contacted you. I bet you don't use these sad excuses on Mr. Jefferson. Don't use them on me, Max. Broken? Man, are you serious? Wow, haven't heard that one in a while. <laughs> Not everything changes. Except my camera has officially taken a shit. My step douche has a boatload of tools. Maybe you can fix it in my place. I need very specific tiny tools. Bird alert. My stepdad has a fully stocked garage. And he actually is a tiny tool. <laughs> Welcome home, Max. I like her. And I also want her hair. Come on in, don't be shy. The house still looks nice. Home, shit, home. <laughs> I really like her. She cracks me up. Glad she didn't die. Interesting. Hold to another universe. Everybody lies, no exceptions. My room looks a bit different than the last time you saw it. It's cool. At least we can chill out. This isn't exactly my chill out zone. My step fear makes sure of that. Come in and close the door. Put on some music while I medicate. Oh. There's a stereo. Stereo. It won't play without any power. Why the fuck keeps it unplugged? That looks like your old room. <laughs> you had a good looking room. My room was kind of boring. Now, let's see what kind of music Chloe is into these days. Why is that? Now, let's see what kind of music Chloe is into these days. Yeah. Turn the 
to like look at the CDs down there, but it won't let me. I guess we won't see what kind of TV shows or things hey, we do. Hey, that TV used to be in the living room. Nerd. Look at that. Chloe and her dad were so close. Oh. Chloe's trash overflowing. <laughs> okay, Chloe, a metal box under the bed equals secret. Is this a desk or a storage space? She looks super happy. Let me finish, I can't cooking enough. Oh, nice. She looks super sad. She looks super stoned. <laughs> Doesn't care that she's going through her stuff, I guess. I know what you meant when you typed hiking. We had such a blast drawing these together. Mm -hmm. So tell me, what does Max Caulfield do for fun now that she's a grown up? I don't feel grown up, I'm just more confused as I get older, especially after today. Gee, thanks. I was hoping to hear something positive. <laughs> about me? No, about me. Duh. I thought you'd at least be happy taking photos. Forget it. So tell me. What does Max Caulfield do for fun now that she's a girl? I take photos. Of me, the world, everything. It may sound sad, but I have a blast. It doesn't sound that sad. I'm happiest when I've got a great image in my lens. I'm not lonely, not afraid. Now that's more inspiring. I don't feel so totally helpless. I'd rather have a life of oh wells than a life of what ifs. I like that. Oops, I didn't mean it that. It's here, Max. Look a little harder. What? I don't have into them. Too pretentious. Now, let's see what kind of music Chloe is into these days. I think this junk swallowed her discs. So you do have to do the mailbox? Yes, I was going to go to next. Hey, give me that. Sorry. I wasn't trying to be nosy. Obviously, she was a good friend. Putting it mildly. I was like, oh, that was missing. Oh, no. That's Rachel Amber. Her missing person posters are all over Blackwell. Yeah, I put them up. She was my angel. After my dad died and you moved, I felt abandoned. Mm -hmm. Rachel saved my life. Man, I had no idea. Well, you never made much effort to find out. I was 14. We were best friends. I never forgot. Even if I was an asshole and didn't keep in touch. But you had Rachel. Rachel had my back. We were gonna kick the world's ass. You would laugh at how different we were. <clears throat> she wanted to be a star. She looks like a model. That was her plan. Our plan. Get the hell out of Bigfootville and into Los Angeles. So what happened? Did your folks, your mom, try to stop you? My mom was too busy hooked up with Sergeant Shithead. <laughs> I feel the love. Now, when did Rachel actually disappear? Six months ago. She just left Arcadia. Without a word. Without me. She murdered? I feel like she was murdered. 
How do you know she disappeared? Maybe she wanted to start a totally new life. Unlike you, she would have told me, okay? Something happened to her. I believe you. I'm just trying to get all deducted. Before Rachel left, she said she met somebody who changed her life. And poof. And you haven't heard anything from her since? Like everybody in my life. My dad, you, and Rachel. Gone. Can you put on some music now? Cranky. She's very pleasant. Anyway, you can find tools to fix your camera in the garage. Chloe, are you okay? Sure, I'm awesome. I just want to blaze and be alone for a moment. Okay, yeah, crank a bit. Nope. Someone locked it from the other side. Oh, well, that guy is an asshole. I haven't seen this place in five years. It seems like forever. I should be able to find the tools I need here. These are way too Could cool. go high and not be cranky. TV. What the? Probably something not appropriate. Chloe's stepdad actually installed cameras in the rooms? For reals? This guy has serious trust issues. Do Chloe and Joyce even know about this? That's creepy. Wow, sir. A map of Blackwell Academy. I wonder why. Maybe he's the one that took that girl. Chloe's stepdad is head of security at Blackwell. Oh God, he wants to put one? surveillance cameras all over the school? How paranoid can you get? Oh, lovely. Chloe's stepdad is a veteran and a security guard? He must really hate her. He's very nosy. Oh, yeah, we're not gonna open that. Yes! Score! <laughs> Nothing. This is so lame. Shortage stalker. Yeah, just a little. No password. Finally, someone has password. Find tools anyway. Finally, someone password protects. Pictures of the girl that went missing. Marsh. Why the hell would he have pictures of her? Okay, this is getting totally weird. Tools in here. Oh, I don't know. Food. 
Look. Check out the muscle car. Chloe's stepdad must be a gearhead. I think I checked everything for tools. Oh, I did not. Ooh, precision screwdrivers. Except I can't reach them. Smart. That was very smart, dumbass. No can reach. How could she not reach that? should have done that before they fell. <laughs> you left the files? What do I do with them? They won't let me do anything with them. Grr, arg. Thank you, Victoria, for the follow. Or do I just rewind time, I guess? Oh yeah, that's what I'm supposed to do. She does remember everything, so. Alright, let's push that out of there. And turn that off. So it doesn't find out, okay. Thanks! <laughs> Sometimes I forget that I can yes, rewind time. You have mad skills, man. She's supposed to work at. I've got the tools. I should go back upstairs before Chloe freaks. Turns her room. Found the tools. Sweet. You can sit at my desk and fix your camera. My bra keeps like snapping itself. So? I can't fix this thing. Are these your new photos? Yeah. I just took them today. Let me see. Wait. I've seen this before. Uh, no way. When did you take this? You took this photo, you brat? In the bathroom today. You set off the alarm. That's why Nathan raged after you. It's the only makes camera. sense. Oops. I'll well, save my life. Now tell me the truth, Max. I was there. Hiding in the corner. Damn, you are a ninja. A ninja <laughs> would have cut Nathan's head off. I just took a butterfly photo. That is so badass. Oh yeah, I almost wet myself when I saw the gun. So, did you recognize me? I wasn't sure. I know I looked a lot different. I was scared too. I, I couldn't see straight. I don't blame you, Max. Like you said, it's been that kind of day. So you must have overheard our conversation. Just a bit. There's no way you didn't hear every single vowel. Okay, I only heard something about money. Drugs. But that's it. Now for the big question. Did you tell anybody? I wanted to. What if he goes on some rampage? Nathan fronts like a thug, but he's a spoiled punk-ass biatch. <laughs> he have shot you, Chloe. That's a fact. She is my favorite. I should tell the principal. The principal? Are you still 12? <laughs> that drunk jackass only cares about cash from Blackwell Academy. Don't trust him. Seriously, I didn't blab to anybody. I promise. Thank God. I'll tell you more someday. And I seriously owe you, Max. Uh, 
I, uh, know it was your birthday last month. This was my real father's camera. I want you to have it. That's mm -hmm. so cool you remembered my birthday. But I can't take this. Of course you can. My dad would be pissed if I never used it, and now I know it'll be used awesomely. And I'll snag this picture as a symbol of our reunion. Cool? Yes, of course it's cool. Thank you. This camera is so sweet. Now that we get that mushy shit out of the way, I feel like stage diving. Let's thrash this place. You're crazy. Yep, yep, I'm fucking insane in the brain. Let's dance! Shake that bony white ass. Or <laughs> take my picture with your new camera. <laughs> This day couldn't get any stranger. I like her. Can she be my friend? This song fucking rules. Can't dance, hippie? Come on! Rock out, girl! Yes! Break it down, Max! <clears throat> Yo, turn it off! Turn it off! Dude, the music's not even on! Oh, no fucking way. You need to hide now. My stepdad will kill me if he finds you here. Chill, I'm changing. Is that okay? Max, find a place to hide now. Chloe, I'm coming. You Chloe, you're stalling. I'm changing. Give me a minute. Right, right. Smart. Just let me in. Please. One second! My bra is stuck! What are you doing? Chloe, you're stalling! I'm changing! Give me a minute! Don't get smart! Just let me in! Now! Please! One second! My bra is stuck! I'm not screwing around, soldier! Chloe! Shit! What's going on in here? Jesus, I'm just trying on clothes. You're so friggin' paranoid. Yeah, combat will do that to you. One of my guns is missing. Did you take it? Oh, God, I didn't take your stupid gun. You do not believe in gun control? Wait, is that grass? You been token up again in here? Oh, yeah, guns, weed. You're tripping balls. I'm sick of your disrespect. Tell me the truth. That's an order. Whose is it? Step it. I'm sorry. That was my joint. Well, well. I don't like strangers in my home. Especially dopers. So you're bringing drugs into my home. How about if I call the police? That'd screw up your spotless Blackwell record. You do seem to get around, Max. I'm sick of you losers dragging Chloe down. Missy, you sure do like to pop up and start trouble. Like this afternoon. You don't have anything smart to say now, do Get you? Get the hell away from huh? her, man. Stop harassing my friends. You don't have any friends. Like you know. You're not even a real cop. You're a fucking security guard. <laughs> I was a soldier, Chloe. Rip. And Max, if I see you here again, you'll learn all about real trouble. <laughs> because you're such a badass, Max. Let me show you my new toy. I'm Price. Chloe Price. Bang! Jesus, put that thing down. Relax, sister. It's not even loaded. Yet. I thought you believed in gun control. Yes, I believe I should control the gun. It's the men who need to be checked. Do you trust Nathan or David? Thanks for taking the heat. We totally smacked his punk ass down, Max. He's no match for you and me now. That was an epic win. It's very strange. Anyway, let's sneak out the window. There is one cool place we can hang in this hickle. Man, that did not go well for me. If I want to keep my Blackwell scholarship, I shouldn't lie for anybody, even Chloe. I have to think about my own future. It's only worth it to lie. Whatever. R.I.P. Scholarship.